Hi everyone, this is Devin Coombs, and today I will be covering problem 7 of CSUN's Gateway Lab Exams for Financial Accounting. Uh, so problem 7 reads, a company normally sells its products for $20 per unit, which includes a profit margin of 25%. However, the selling price has fallen to $15 per unit. This company's current inventory consists of 200 units purchased at $16 per unit. Replacement cost has fallen to $15 per unit. Calculate the value of the inventory at the lower of cost or market, and then an assortment of answers. So the big question here is how do we calculate lower of cost or market? Because we're given a lot of numbers. So what we could start off by doing is by figuring out our profit margin, which if we multiply 20 by the 25%, we get the $5, which means our total price per unit is $25. And we can make a whole calculation based off of that, but that's the misleading part. Uh, and that's what a lot of people do, and that's not the correct way to do it. The way we're supposed to do it is find the lower of cost or the market value. So don't be looking at price or selling points. We just need to find the difference between how much we bought the inventory for, for and how much it's actually worth on the market now. And then lower of cost or market requires us to write down the inventory to the lower of either of those values. Uh, that way, on our financial statements, the company will have more accurate and useful financial information for financial statement users. So we multiply out the 200 units by the $16 per unit by we per that we purchased it at to get our $3,200 of cost. Then, we now know that the replacement cost for the units is $13 per unit. So that's obviously less than the $16 per unit that we purchased it for, so we're going to have to write down to that market value. So 200 times $13 is $2,600. Then we find the lower of each, which is obviously the market value, and we would write down the inventory to $2,600. So as you can see, the answer is B, $2,600. I hope that helps, and our next video will be on question 8 and 9. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video.